hello guys welcome to my channel so i'll be going through my comment section again so there is not many comment there is just one so anuj is asking uh, for closing the applications rather than closing files so i have made a video on closing files on which anuj unfortunately wrote something else and now he is requesting for closing applications uh, for this project basically so uh, Anuj for you um, closing application and web browser that is just one thing so if you can close any application that means you can close the web browser also so that is uh, that is same thing and you can achieve both of them by doing the same thing so uh, before going into the code if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do if you are not liking my videos if you like my content then please like my video otherwise there is a dislike button you can always do that and if you want anything specific you can always write down on the comment section i'll i'll make a video for that and without wasting any time let's start with the code so for this video i wrote this uh, small script so i'll be using that so in that i was using task kill command to close the notepad.exe so let's see how it was working so if you haven't gone through this uh, video you ha don't have to you just uh, you look at this command what this is doing so basically if i open my notepad okay so this notepad is an application which is being opened so if you open your task manager you can see that the, these many applications are opened in your system so these many application you can close so if you run this it will close the notepad so as you see notepad is closed so um, just like that we can do many things so um, let me copy this command and let's try a few things okay so i think this sh should suffice so let me open um notepad plus plus also okay um let me open command prompt okay and let me open sublime text um intellij snipping tool so that's a lot of application now so let's um minimize this okay so notepad is done so if you want to see the name don't look at the name here expand this right click on it oh sorry right click on this go to um, details and the name is this one so you have to refer to this name so notepad plus plus now you want uh, for let's say chrome so these are many chromes so if you see there are many chromes if you go to this you can see all of these instances and there are different different process id but when you write chrome.exe it will close all the tabs not just one all the tabs so chrome.exe and uh, then command prompt so for command prompt we already know it is cmd.exe if you want to look at it it's pretty easy uh, go to details and if you see cmd.exe then um, sublime text intellij so let's first go to intellij okay it's idea64.exe okay now let's go to sublime text so it's sublime underscore text okay now what which is left uh, snipping tool so snipping tool sorry um, go to details okay so um, this will be really quick and we won't be able to see uh, but if you want to pause for a duration so that we can see if it is doing it in a timely manner or not so what you can do is you can use time dot sleep and let's do three seconds and copy this and then paste it after each command so that you will see a pause and that way it will be more clear that is it able to close all the applications or not so save this and open your process tab here so that you can see run it okay so let's see 
so first is notepad is notepad is closed notepad plus plus is closed okay now your chrome is closed cmd is closed idea 64 is closed sublime text is closed and snipping tool is closed uh, <laughs> sorry for the commentary but as you see all the applications have been closed so this is really simple this is how you can achieve that so Anuj I thank you again for asking the question and again if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet if you are the new viewer of this channel please subscribe to the button it won't ask you much like there is nothing to pay it's free so you can always press that button it will motivate me for making more videos and that's it that's it for the day thank you again have a good day bye bye